Hey guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you how to fix Shopify failed to load the page. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. Now having this issue here on Shopify can be kind of frustrating. So there are a few things that you can do here to probably solve this issue. So one of them is to actually change a few things or settings here. So first things first is you need to determine if your Shopify page actually worked before. Now, if you know or are you sure that your Shopify page actually worked before, like in this case, if you've recently installed an app into your store and suddenly it doesn't it does not work, it means that the app that you've installed or any settings that you've changed here might be the cause of the actual issue. So the simple step for you to fix this is to basically backtrack on the apps or the steps that you did. Like for example, if you installed an app before, you could go to settings here and you want to go to app and sales channel. And from here, you want to go and uninstall the actual app that you actually installed recently. Now, once you've uninstalled that, go ahead and see if that solves the issue. Now, if that doesn't solve the issue, the next thing you want to do is you want to determine if the issue itself is caused by your browser. Now, in this case, you go and visit your Shopify page here. Go and copy the actual address and you want to go to incognito. Now, incognito, you go and paste your page or in this little link here and basically access your store. Now, if your store actually loads up in uh, incognito mode, it means the problem itself is your browser. So typically, you need to go to the top right here, click on the tree dotted icon, and you want to click on delete browsing data option here. In this case, you go and choose browsing history, download history, cookies and other site data, cache images and files, and some other section here, which the most important part is going to be site settings here. But once you've selected that, you go and click on the time range here. So I would uh, actually uh, uh, suggest you try using all time here, but then again, it will delete all the browsing data they have here. But once you've done that, selected that, go ahead and click on create uh, delete data here and we'll just wait for the process to complete. Now, once you've done that, go ahead and just, uh, reload your Shopify page here or your tab here and see if that solves the issue. And that's about it. So hopefully this video is able to help you like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.